Hello everyone, this is Fantastic Worlds, welcome you back to Lovecraft Country and Lovecraft Country Classics. Yeah, this is something I'm just throwing in here. I put this game up for um, voting for, for my supporters, because supporters can actually uh, vote for material that goes for extra episodes, but I found nostalgia hit me, and we've got a week before we start the next series. Yeah, the next series vote for my subscribers is over and closed as of noon today. Pacific Standard Time, so therefore it's already been chosen, but I'm going to reveal that on the 28th, which one it is, and again, next week we'll be starting the next Cult of Simulator set of episodes. It's probably going to be first the Exile DLC run, and then after that I will do the Grimoire, simply because the Grimoire is taking a little extra time to record, this is on a standard episode, but in the meantime, let's have a little fun with something I misspent my youth on, which is Nightmare Harris 2. See, back in the day, back in the day when Half-Life 2 was the cutting edge of gaming, mm. it'll be a casual run, so I will be drinking. Coffee, mind you. I don't really shoot well with alcohol. But Anne's going to say that, um, yeah, back in the day when Half-Life 2 was the height of gaming technology, what happens is they dropped a whole bunch of what are called mod packs. Basically the ability to for um, people to independently develop their own games using the assets and engine. And a number of very interesting horror games came out as a result. This is probably one of the better known ones. And the reason why I'm selecting this one over, say, Cry of Fear or God, there was this lovely du dual pack once again. I've got to find that one at some point. Is because, well, we're going to have to have another vote after the next series. And the people who made this called We Create Stuff suddenly came out of retirement because it's this came out in 2003, I think, and put together the demo for another game. And I'll probably be running that as a let's try for the next series. But. In the meantime, let's see what they managed to do when they had no money, no budget, a bunch of assets, and a lot of imagination. Let's enter the Nightmare House 2. And by the way, even though it's called Nightmare House 2, the first chapter is in fact the first game. It's kind of a proof of concept they did originally. And then they created this. Now I'm going to shift the audio settings, so give me a second here. Once we get to the game itself, it's going to be, oh my god, uh, quiet compared to this. For some reason they decided to act like there's a blower going on here. All right, we're going to start with the prologue. Start your game. All right. Recreate Stuff presents. Oops, oh god, where is the music off this track? Well, oh, you got that at full volume. Hang on, guys. Nightmare House, the prologue. Crows do not ex do come out at night. Okay, so we start off with a flashlight. It looks like we rammed our utility truck. I meant literally like a utility truck for a power station here. So, of course, after having an accident, the first thing we're going to do is we're going to check out these lights down here, because obviously, oh my god, the audio. Hang on. Mm, that sounds like I'm trying to shout over and... There we go. That's better. I tried altering this from the inside, but it turns out the music doesn't actually, um go down when you ask for the music to go down. Yeah, I'm sure this this house... Ooh. Okay, so the moon is falling to the earth, so I guess Majora's Mask is happening over there. Um, so, yeah. This looks like we should go like friendly people. There's no lights on. I guess we're gonna have to do some little B&E ourselves. Ah! Tempted jump scare there. Alright, so... Right, so... As you can see, since we're doing a Half-Life mod, we've got the ability to pick up and throw things using the physics engine. Ooh, bicycle. You know, if I was running this in the real world, I'd probably just grab the bike and go. I mean, it's blood spattered everywhere. We're probably gonna end up as, you know, some slasher victim. Ooh, can't use it as a weapon? That sucks. Can throw it though. But we can use this as a weapon. All right, main attack, light, secondary heavy. All right, should probably turn the flashlight off. I mean, we don't need it while we're in this section right here, the Hazlight. And maintaining your batteries, flashlight for your batteries is kind of important. Because you don't want to go out in the middle of a fight. And so if you can live without it, you probably should. Anyways, let's go knock on the front door with an axe and see what happens. Because apparently they're having a bad day. Oh, come on. You can't hit that. Uh, I guess it's breakable glass. All right, cool. As you can see, a lot of objects are in fact destroyable. And I will be destroying a lot of them. There! No no ammo pack and... I'm not striking the uh, propane tank. 
All right, so that's the locked door signal. We're reading that a lot. But frankly, since it's covered in blood, I don't think I want to go. But we're going to shoo all reason, by the way. And we're going to walk into the basement of the murder house. Come on. There are both. Probably shouldn't have stood on it. You know, sometimes uh, I don't have... I see we're not up to OSHA. Another bike. Yeesh. These people are apparently into health before they died. All right, out of my way. There's a door here. Well, yeah, I could probably just pick this up. No reason to be completely Charles Manson about it. All right, so let's see if we've got anything else around here. Interesting that while I'm in the dark, the flashlight battery does not, in fact, go down. Probably should knock that in my own way. All right. All right, so... The true horror. Leaving your own doors open behind you. Anyways, that sometimes do that in tact game games list is sometimes a tactical way, because if I can hear the door opening behind me when somebody's coming with an axe, because they'll spawn sometimes out of nowhere. Um Okay, so apparently the basement's got some flooding issues. I'm not gonna be able to do my laundry. Alright, cool. There's always like a bucket of old paint and like you know, insecticides in everything, I swear. All right, so... No, no water. All right, so let's see what we got. Hi, ah, oh. That's what happened to the last guy who was sent to the service call, huh? Are you gonna get up on me? And he's got a gun? Oh, man. Thing is, it's not a suicide because, you know, he wouldn't put the gun down slowly, but we've got nine rounds, nothing reserved. But, yeah, I remember these controls from before. But we can... Switch back to the axe, take care of our problems. We'll be using this axe a lot. See, it's a, it's actually a reskin of the Half-Life Crowbar, but frankly, I prefer the axe. Okay, so this is going to be too far to jump. So, what we need to do is a physics-based bu puzzle, as I called it. Let's make our own bridge. All right, that looks sturdy. So, we're going to come out of the basement. Oh, no. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. There you go. Let's try it again. We're gonna come busting out of the uh, basement like Jason Voorhees found found a uh, couple of campers sleeping. Speaking of which, I wonder if this is supposed to be a Shining reference. Well, not the body on the floor. All right, come on, you. All right, no wait. Where's the? Uh, give me a second. Forgetly forgotten which controls to crouch. Duck is control. I, I was hitting control, so that's a lie. Oh, there we go. It wasn't in control. I was hitting. Wait. Oh, you gotta hold it down. Well, that sucks. Be doing that a lot. Yeah, I see you. Ah, yeah, I saw you, brother. Oh, that sucked. Lost like 30 health there. Oh my god. It must have been a hell of a hell of a diarrheic episode. All right, so this looks safe. I feel safe here. Uh, oh, I got ammo. Didn't even realize it. All right, you close. Your Gods. All right then. So this door. No. So this way. I can get. God damn it. This place is a... I was going to say a death trap. That's kind of obvious. But first, let's see if this goes anywhere. Come on. You're a destructible environment. Destruct. And it's hard to tell which boards are supposed to last and which ones are supposed to just uh, knock down. It looks like this is done. We're supposed to knock... We're supposed to last. All right, so, yeah. We're not obviously going to retreat, so... Oh, yeah, there's an open. And they're making a bust out of it. Hey, look. It's a uh, picture you can get off the internet for free. Okay, okay, blood, uh, I don't know which is... Oh, hey, who's there? The hell? Poltergeists? Just so rude. Alright, so I'd rather be with the blood stains. thanks. Eesh. Oh, another co Creative Commons uh, picture. Ah, well, I feel safe going this way. I mean, this is... Oh, Jesus! Oh no. 
Oh no. Long haired stringy ghost girl. Oh, hi. Maybe I should switch to the gun. I mean, the axe is just good at close quarters, because this guy is obviously trying to ambush us, and I like the blood spatter. Alright, so... Oh, there's nothing good on. What the... Oh, hi! Thanks! Little ghost girl. I'm gonna check over here for supplies first. Alright, cool. Oh, yes, ammo. I always love ammo. Probably should start using it. Alright. Alma, you like moonlighting? Well, she's she's polite. I'll give her that. Alright, alright. Alright, all right. Jesus! Although she's not good at home maintenance, apparently. What the heck are we supposed to be doing here? Um, did we clip badly? Oh, gods. How are we going to get out of this? All right. Jack. Oh, we're going to have to save for something. Maybe go back from an old save or something. I should probably save more often. All right. So, okay, okay. Ah, so over here in the pi uh, on the on the pipes. Don't just look at the pipes, dude. Oh, gods. Ugh. This is thrilling. All right, let's try... All right, cool. Almost there. All right, so from here, what are we supposed to do? We're supposed to get onto this thing? All right, all right, all right, all right, there, there. Okay, so which way we're supposed to be going is what I want to know. Not that way, so we got on the wrong side, of course. We, yeah, we just get on the side here. Now what? Must be something we're doing down there. Uh, I don't know. Maybe we'll try the other way. Mm-hmm. Okay, so we're supposed to stay and do something in the basement, maybe? We do some hacking and slashing? I don't know. Uh, before I go down there, let's save. All right, so. Let's see what we're supposed to do here. Anything? Maybe the blood stained area. Maybe not. Maybe down? I don't know. Oh, wrong button. All right. Oh, so this is, is where we're supposed to go. How many basements does this place have? Oh, gods. Ugh. No, we'll keep... Let's, yeah, let's switch out. Just in case. I need to pop a cap. All right. All right. Not the most efficient way to do your sunbathing. Okay, you're making me move slow. Oh, well, yes, it's always good to have a little playtime. Oh, these are your footsteps. Great. Ah! Did some... Ah. Let's eh, switch back. There's just a lot of ammo. These guys don't carry anything either. Apparently, Ama, like I said, is um moonlighting. Oh, come on. Stop just hanging around. I'll slap myself for that later. Yeah, that's how I'm unimpressed I am about your little tricks here. All right, what do you got? Oh, a revolver. Cool. Well, still got more ammo for this one. And I still like the axe. Yeah. That's it. For all your tricks, I'm messing up your furniture. Lady, stop it. Not impressed. Uh, all right, we should probably just move along here. Okay. More blood. Always follow the trails of blood. All right. All right, cool. Revolver it is. All right, feeling good. No gun, though. 
Sometimes you can damage them a little by throwing objects, but, you know, that just seems like a lot of work. This seems like less work. All right, all right, who's there? Well, that wasn't good. Oh, I guess we're supposed to go this way. Another bathroom. Oh, look, a health pack. You got it? You got something to say to me? Do you? Oh, God. Alma, you're just really not working well with here, here. But I will take the uh, shotgun shells. All right. So, 32 and 5. Yep. Fuck off! Jesus! A rather opposite. Gods. Some people are just rude. You always introduce yourself before attacking. It's only polite. Storage. I feel sh I feel like sucker bait here. Right. Hi. You. I get too reliant on this. My shotgun is my favorite melee weapon, by the way. Mm, could be stuff in here, those boxes. Come on, give me that. All right, cool, sweet ammo. All right, let's do this. Show me what you've got. Now, I don't remember if... I know in the game proper, Half-Life 2, stuff can be inside of crates, but doesn't look like we're getting any luck here. Yeah, come on. No, no, storage space just had some shotgun shells. Oh, fuck off, dude. Ugh, I suppose I'd be upset too if that's all I had, but there's nothing in here. Great. All of that for just... Oh, a key. Come on. How am I supposed to get that? Uh, crouch. Come on, give me the key. Ugh. Oh, uh, come on. That's five. Yeah, there we go. Missed. Got a glowing he here, and I can't get to it. This is going to cause me issues in the future, isn't it? This is generous of the ammo. I appreciate that. Oh, 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 a key is required, you say. Perhaps you'd like to give it to me. Ugh. I'm gonna have to restart and do this again, aren't I? I mean, or I could just, come on. Let me destroy the shelf. Ugh. Hate it when these bugs happen. Uh, okay, last time I saved, however, is there an autosave? Okay, load game. Which is kind of. Alright, there we go. Load. Sorry about this, but um, apparently we're gonna be dealing with bugs. Again, rude. Alright, so we already know what's gonna happen here, so let's get it over with. Come on, come on. Come on, Slowpoke. Uh, you know what, I'm not even gonna waste a shell on you. You, on the other hand, annoy me. All right. Okay, we know there's shells over here. We know we have to go in here, and we know there's gonna be a problem here. So. Now there's no more problem. <sighs> oh. What the heck? Are we supposed to just carry the damn thing? Alright, cool. Answering the question whether or not a... Alright, cool, cool. This is what we do? It's right here. Okay, so that's a little annoying, but it exists. So, that wasn't an, a bug before. Ah, well, live and learn. 
reboot and oh wonderful the house is breathing all right so who's next i have a 12 gauge and the ability to fix about 32 problems oh for crying out loud all right so if you didn't want me to go this way why did you breathe at me so heavily Now I gotta figure out where they want, where they're trying to direct us here. There's no other way to go. Again, hopefully not a bug. All right, let me ask you a axe before quite entering. All right, that's not gonna work. All right, so cool. We'll just go this way, I guess. I guess I would manage to go backwards. All right, like I said, my favorite melee weapon. Yeah, you know, I know it takes a lot to code for a reflection, but oh my god, you didn't have to go that far. You're gonna flip up? Eh, free out loud. That's it, I'm taking out some frustration. Maybe there's something hidden here? Come on. Alright, so, so far, the decision to walk into this strange blood spatter house has been nothing but win. Alright. I'm sorry I didn't knock. Ah, uh, sigh. I like the ambience, but... Oh! Well, I, you're undead, I know. You're getting a little cold. You want to, um, stand by the fire. Oh, hang on. I think there's some ammo here. All right, cool. Oh, lots of bullets. What do we have for a revolver? Revolver's full up. Oosh, gods. You need to be a little more... Less frugal with the weapons. All right. Speaking of, that's uh, still though. I'm not gonna waste ammo on this. Oh, there's the other half of him. All right then. Okay, so just out of my way. All right, so this is where he was supposed to go. Yeah, this... Did we just come in a circle? Alright, so we have to jump this, I guess. And we do it. Excellent. Completely dark area. And I said, any supplies we need? Yeah, okay, cool, we got supplies. What the hell? Okay. Like I said, solving problems. Yeesh! One problem can't be solved, though. Apparently, Alma is definitely onto us. At least it's hoping not, it's gonna end. Hopefully, it'll end better than a uh, Fear Two did. Ugh. Those of you who know what I'm saying know what I'm saying. Ugh. Apparently, she's not into ambient light. You know, fool me with the corner trick once. You guys think it's like the greatest e uh, tactic ever. No. Oh. Doesn't look ominous in any way or form. Alright, so we've got like more ammunition than we know what to do with, and that's usually a bad sign. Totally didn't panic there. <sighs> Reload. Okay, you're reloaded. Okay, so that happened. And we fell back down. All right, don't do that. It's not smart. Okay, then. Is this where we came in? Yeah, this is where we came in. So I guess we are supposed to fall down there. Come on, come on, out of the way. Alright, then. Okay, so... Hopefully it's... Ah! Uh, wasted a bullet on the, on the ectoplasm. Oh, hi! Get out.
Come and steady. That's uh, that's me. Just doing some killing. Huh. More ammo. Strangely feel need for it. And... Very generous with the ammo. Well, let's actually use up some of this stuff. Let's see. Kinda sucks, I don't have, Can't use the iron sights. Alright, back to this. I know, Cosmic Horror, where the gun works, don't, is one of the solutions, is not really a horror. Alright, alright, cool, cool, who's, who's out there? Alright, you. I'm just gonna finish you off with the 9 mil because I can. Save the good stuff! Oh, that's not ominous whatsoever. Let's get out of the ominous fog. I feel the sudden need to go back to our car. I don't know why we left it. Oh, gods. Let's just keep going, shall we? Probably walking backwards into some... Oh. Hi, are you here to give me a lift? Well, technically we have, because we're moving on to the sequels part, but, um... Just let me take a brief break here, but yeah, that's the beginning of Nightmare House. With the original one came out like this was the proof of concept, and it was it was a nice little goofy thing for you uh you had for the um for free. Because yeah, this game is for free as long as you have the original base game or the assets. But um the thing is about that is that that one everybody wanted a sequel that actually had a story to it. See this the concept of this part of the story is that you were in an accident and this is could have happened or could have been a hallucination but what you do know is where you wake up and that is relatively somewhere unpleasant 